So prior to uh, printing heat shrink tubing markers with the K4350, you have to change the default settings on the print driver. We're going to want to select the start menu, type in printers, and select the printers and scanners. Scroll down to the driver that we installed. Here we named it Croy K4350 300 DPI. Click on it, click Manage, click Printing Preferences. Here's the print driver settings. We want to select Stock. I'm going to change this first uh, method to from Use Current Printer Settings to tr Thermal Transfer. And then the type to Continuous. The media handling is where you turn on the cutter. Uh, we can either turn it on here or we can turn it off and then we can actually tell it when we want to cut. For the default settings I would leave it to none so the cutter is not on and then based on the size of the tubing that you're using when you go to print you can either turn that on or off. We're going to hit apply. We're going to select the options tab deselect the use current printer settings and we're going to change the print speed to 1.5 inches and the darkness to 10. This is starting point if you're using white ribbon uh, you may want to increase this darkness setting uh, or decrease it same thing uh, with black ribbon really depends on the print quality that you're getting when you go to print. We hit apply OK. The default settings are set. We're ready to uh, print markers.